Body cam games are blowing up faster than they can say Allah Akbar. And today, we're jumping into a brand new one that's bound to get wild. And guess what? The dev decides to troll me. Hard. Yes, me. And yes, hard. So stick around to the end and make sure you drop your thoughts in the comments. This one is going to be a hoot. Without further ado, welcome to Fractured Mind. A body cam first person shooter hitting your screens this September. So, grab your popcorn, get back, and get ready to laugh, cry, and maybe scream. Let's get this party started. Here we go. Fractured mind. Subway lost at night. Hopeless. Chris. Pay attention to the small details. You will need five letters to unlock the padlock at the end. The letters are hidden throughout the game. Look around for them. You will need to complete the body before you can proceed. You'll know what I mean later. Oh. This is not a fourth wall break. Yeah, you're right, you're right. Don't waste your bullets. At least not yet. There's nothing to shoot at anyway, okay? Crime. This way. The most wanted? I am doing that with no reason. Doing what? Breaking the fourth wall? Do not enter. Smoke. Fuck communism. I agree there, brother. Whoa. They're just staring at you. Hello, eyeball. Am I in your personal space? Hello? That's so fucking creepy. I don't like this game already. Wait, wait, I gotta look for shit. Winners play here. Fizz Bullseye. Okay, that's more of the rules. Ooh, we got a pew pew. I'll take you. Pew pew's got a flashlight. That's nice. Can we inspect it? Dope. Alright. Smoking is forbidden. Romania. Some might say calling your best friend every day is crazy. Low month, $29. Emergency stop ahead. Passengers. Expect delays. Okay. Northwood B. B. Visiting Romania. Are you guys Romanians? You devs? Destroying subway property. No littering. No smoking. No drinking. No panhandling. No amplification device. No more other than one seat. Blocking free movement. No laying down unauthorized commercial activities. No entering tracks, tunnels. No bulky items. And no radio playing. Okay, we gotta look at the handle. Hmm. Dude, is shit gonna be like hiding and Don't waste your bullets. Okay, I won't. I won't. I get it. I get it. I get it. 
Something will need my bullets, but not yet. Okay, it's still Northwood B. Pretty sure it said something about body parts and letters. Nothing's even happening, but my heart is freaking racing like I'm freaking missing something. Something is about to happen. If I turn around or something there. What about now? Please. All right, we're good. <laughs> <laughs> Romania, we're still B. Bullseye, Fizz. Visit Romania. There is no settings, there is nothing to change. Mental health. Yeah, fuck. I'm not catching any letters. I'm not finding any parts. Don't waste your bullets. Fizz. Romania, passengers B. Spec delays. This one's got me stumped. Puzzle within a puzzle within a puzzle within a First person body cam shooter. Interesting. Romania Fizz. Northwood B. I'm definitely moving too fast, I feel. Since I haven't found a single part or a letter. And you guys are going to be in the comments. It was here. You didn't see. You'd be blind. You dumb. Well, that's my reflection. I'm like, oh, what the hell is that? I got goosebumps on my body now. <laughs> fizz, fizz, fizz. No, you shouldn't drink that shit. Pop be bad.
Uh, I don't like this. The train's stopping. Shit's happening. So is this now where letters and body parts stop coming? Start? B. There's a little box there. It is a bit slow walking and turning. I mean, it's got this field of view. Moving the hand is fast, but as soon as you try and jerk around or something, it takes a long time. So there won't be any defending. We interrupt this program with breaking news. A man has reportedly killed his wife in the quiet suburbs of... Police have been called by scared neighbors as they heard shouting and crying, which they thought was strange coming from their house as this has never happened before. Unfortunately, as the officers arrived on the scene, a loud gunshot was heard echoing through the otherwise quiet night. The police were unable to subdue the husband, so they were forced to open fire. Officers present on the scene have told us that the perpetrator was not responding to their calls to drop the weapon as he appeared in a trance-like state. The victim, 25-year-old Emily, <laughs> was described as being happy, outgoing, and full of life. Her husband, you guys caught that, right? Michael, was seen as a quiet but happy and well-adjusted man. This horrible tragedy has come as a big shock to all the people who knew them, since they have always appeared as a cheerful and in love couple. The motive behind this seemingly strange murder is still under investigation but the police have confirmed a single gunshot wound to the chest was the cause of Emily's demise. The motive that led to this horrific act is still shrouded in mystery. Was it the sudden surge of uncontrollable anger? Or was it the culmination of a long and simmering mental? <laughs> we interrupt this program- Yeah, someone's trying to say something through that. A man has reportedly killed his wife in the quiet suburbs of- so there's no going back now. Hey, X puts it up. That's dope. 28 year old Michael was seen as a quiet but happy and well adjusted man. This horrible tragedy. Yeah, I'm still okay. A big shock to all the people who knew them since they have always appeared as a cheerful and in love couple. is still shrouded in mystery. Was it the sudden surge of uncontrollable anger? Or was it the culmination of a long and simmering mental? Still Romania. If things are changing, besides the exit not being able to go back, I'm not catching it. On the scene, a loud gunshot was heard echoing through the otherwise quiet night. The police were unable to subdue the husband, so they were forced to open fire. Officers present on the scene have told us that the perpetrator was not responding to their calls to drop the weapon as he appeared in a trance-like state. The I wonder if I need to be paying atten more attention. Closer detail. If you are insane, call that number. She pause and you call. <laughs> this is insanity, just continuously walking. The motive behind this seemingly strange murder is still under investigation, but the police have confirmed a single gunshot wound to the chest was the cause of Emily's demise. Now are we the perpetrator? Or are we 
the police officer. Either way, I think we're about to start tripping balls. We interrupt this program with breaking news. A man has reported Shit's about to hit the fan here. Now we can go backwards, okay? Unfortunately, as the officers arrived on the scene, a loud gunshot was heard echoing through the otherwise quiet night. The police were unable to subdue the husband, so they were forced to open fire. Officers present on the scene have told us that the perpetrator was not responding to their calls to drop the weapon as he appeared in a trance like state. Now it's closed. This horrible tragedy has come as a big shock to all the people who knew them, since they have always appeared as a cheerful and in love couple. The motive behind this seemingly strange murder is still under investigation, but the police have confirmed a single gun. What happened to the, the test was the cause of Emily's R9? Demise. The motive that led to this horrific act. No cell phone ad. Mystery. Was it the sudden surge of uncontrollable anger? Or was it the culmination of a long and simmering <laughs> Am I supposed to turn around if shit ain't right? We interrupt this program with breaking news. A man has reportedly You might need them later. You never know what might come after you. I mean, there's nothing to shoot at anyways. Well, not yet, at least. There is a weird which they thought was Oster from their house as to have a subway, by the way. Yeah, see? Cell phone ad. We can't go back any further. Was described as being happy, outgoing, and full of life. Her husband, 28 year old Michael R9, is a quiet but happy and well adjusted man. This horrible tragedy has come as a big shock to all the people who knew them. Now, if I go through here, is it going to then be like, sorry? This seemingly strange murder is still under investigation, but the no. police have confirmed a single gunshot wound to the chest. Was the okay, the cell phone ad's back. The motive that led to this horrific act is still shrouded in mystery. Yeah, that changed. Before it was Romania. Welcome to Romania. To open fire. Officers present on the scene have told us that the purposed man. I'm so focused trying to figure out what the fuck to all the people who knew them since they have always appeared surge of uncontrollable anger. Still in B. The culmination of a long and simmering Unfortunately, as the officers Every time I turn around, I get a chill of goosebumps. Dude, I kind of wish that the the radio wasn't Wasn't going. Twenty-eight-year-old Michael was seen as a quiet but happy and I feel like it's making it worse. It's more scurry. Tragedy has come as a big shock to all the people who. Even though literally nothing is happening. Just the anticipation. And I definitely feel like it wants me to be turned around and shit. Still shrouded in mystery. Was it the sudden surge of uncontrollable anger? Or was it the culmination of a long and simmering mental? This is literally hell. Gee, if I did something wrong, <laughs> I got sent to hell. This would be it. His wife in the quiet suburbs of just the endless menial loop. scared neighbors as they heard shouting and crying, which they thought was strange. And like, I really just want to... Shoot, let's make sure that it actually works. Her husband, 28-year-old Michael Murphy, was seen as a quiet but happy and well-adjusted man. This horrible tragedy has come as a big shock to all the people... Man, it would be really rad if there was a sprint. We're definitely some SWAT dude, look at us. Got like headgear on. Still under investigation, but the police have confirmed a 
single gunshot wound to the chest. This police officer has to be going out of his fucking mind. How long is this damn train? The police were unable to subdue the husband, so they were forced to open fire. Yeah, look at our shadow. Definitely have tactical gear on, bomb gear. Something like that. murder is still under investigation, but the police have confirmed a single gunshot wound to the chest was the cause of Emily's demise. The motive that led to this horrific act is still... We are closed. Was it the sudden surge of uncontrollable anger? Or was it the culmination of a long and simmering mental... <laughs> I have the feeling that the radio is talking about us. We go crazy because of this damn train. Hey, you gotta look. You gotta look. Malarkey. Okay, we'll just wait here until the uh, train comes to a stop. Oh wait, it already has came to a stop. That led to this horrific act is still Hello? mystery. Hello. Can you help me? A sudden surge of uncontrollable anger. I can't call the attendant. It's not working. Simmering men. I'm not catching it. I am not. Because there is nothing to catch. From their house, as this has never happened before. Unfortunately, has the in full of life. This developer is an asshole. Very fucking asshole. It was like, what, five body parts and five letters? Haven't found one yet? ...appeared as a cheerful and in love couple. The motive behind this seemingly strange murder is still under investigation. Five letters in a body. ...confirmed a single gun... These doors are getting the better of me. Bullseye, Chicago Bulls? Casino. Go and waste your money. I wonder if the idea is for the gun to be all blurred like that. I mean, I would like to have it to have detail. Her husband, 28 year old Michael, was seen. Under investigation, but the police have confirmed a single gunshot wound to the chest was the cause of Emily's demise. The motive that led to this horrific act is still shrouded in mystery. Was it the sudden surge of uncontrollable anger? There's nothing here. Or was it the culmination of a long and simmering men? Horrific <laughs> act is still shrouded. Going on with in that window. Was it the sudden surge of uncontrollable anger? Or is that was blood? It of a long and simmering men? Just glitching. Yeah, just glitching. No, I'm not okay. I'm not at all. The fuck is going on? Why does this train keep going and going and going? Coming from their house as this has never happened before. Unfortunately, as the officers arrived on the scene. A loud gunshot was heard echoing through the otherwise quiet night. The police were unable to subdue the husband, so they were forced to open fire. Officers present on the scene have told us that the perpetrator was not responding to their calls to drop the weapon as he appeared in a trance-like state. The victim, 25-year-old Emily, was described as being happy, outgoing, and full of life. Her husband, 28-year-old... Now I wonder if uh, this is a real incident that they're going on about the radio. Is that a real radio clip? Or is that just some scripted narrative? Which they thought was strange coming from their house as this has never happened before. Unfortunately, as the officers arrived on the scene, a loud gunshot was heard echoing through the other one. like that. Ooh, that was pretty. That was pretty. Now, did that trigger something from all this? No shooting. Save your bullets. The victim, 25-year-old Emily. Shut the hell up. Being happy, outgoing, and full of life. 
her husband. Still 12. Still 12. Still B. These two keep changing. The motive behind this seemingly strange murder is still under investigation, but the police have confirmed a single gunshot wound to the chest was the cause of Emily's demise. Crazy. That's five. Inpatient referral for psychiatric industries. So yeah, we're crazy. We're cuckoo 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 cuckoo. I think I'm a walrus. This has never happened before. Unfortunately, as the officers arrived on the scene, a loud gunshot was heard echoing through the otherwise quiet night. Oh, we are the cop, right? So, we're the one that got shot in the chest. And this is hell. We're just the endless loop at the hospital in a coma. There's no lean, okay. Hmm. Emily's demise. The motive that led to this horrific act is still shrouded in mystery. Was it the sudden surge of uncontrollable anger? Or was it the culmination of a long and Maybe I need to listen to that once again. Listen more closely. Maybe it's telling me something. But I don't think so. If I recall correctly, it's just in the quiet suburb a narrative. Police have been called by scared neighbors as they heard shouting and crying, which they thought was strange coming from their house as this has never happened before. No exit, emergencies only. They were forced to open fire. Officers present on the scene have told us that the perpetrator was not responding to their calls to drop the weapon. As he appeared no. in a trance like state. Doesn't open, that doesn't open. The victim, twenty five year old Emily <laughs> was described as being happy, outgoing, and full of life. Her husband, twenty eight year old. So I read the the crazy paper once and then it hasn't been there yet, and then I start talking about it and here it is. Appeared as a cheerful and in love couple. Is the game listening to me? Is it reading my mind? Certainly not. Kind of psychological shenanigans is going on here. Because that's all this is psychological. I don't think I'm supposed to actually be looking for something. I don't think that. There's going to be body parts that we got to find. We got to make a body. They could just fucking with us. It's one giant troll. No, I'm not. Okay, dude. This is... Badonk -a donk This horrible tragedy has come as a big shock to all the people who knew them, since they have always appeared as a cheerful and in love couple. The motive behind this seemingly strange murder is still under investigation. Some shit's going on that I'm not getting. Or was it the culmination of a long and simmering men? <laughs> we interrupt this program with breaking news. A man has reportedly killed his wife. They thought was strange coming from their house. 
says this has never happened before. Unfortunately, as the officers arrived on the scene, okay, man. a gunshot was heard okay. going through the otherwise quiet The night. fuck is going on? The police were unable to subdue the husband, so seemingly strange murder is still under investigation. But the police have confirmed a single gunshot wound to the chest was the cause of Emily's demise. The motive that led to this horrific... Yeah, we got some fate. That's very nice, it's very nice. has never happened before. Unfortunately, as the officers arrived on the scene, a loud gunshot was heard echoing through the otherwise quiet night. The police were unable to subdue the husband, so they were forced to open fire. Officers present on the scene have told us that the perpetrator was not responding to their calls to drop the weapon as he appeared in a trance-like state. The victim, 25-year-old Emily, <laughs> was described as being happy, outgoing, and full of life. Her husband, 28-year-old Michael, was seen as a quiet but happy and well-adjusted man. This horrible tragedy has come as a big shock to all the people who knew them, since they have always appeared as a cheerful and in-love couple. The motive behind this seemingly strange murder is still under investigation, but the police have confirmed a single gunshot wound to the... Okay, so it's, uh, it's not us. We're not dead. It says closed. Confirmed a single gunshot wound to the chest was the cause of Emily's demise. The motive that led to this horrific act is still shrouded in mystery. Was it the sudden surge of uncontrollable anger? Or was it the culmination of a long and simmering? <laughs> Yeah, I definitely think that the uh, dev is trolling. It's been 10 minutes since I said that last. Police have been called by I think, yeah, I'm going to need to be admitted to the psychiatric institute after, after this. I mean, nothing's news. happened. Absolutely a nothing. Reportedly killed his wife in the quiet suburbs of. Program with breaking news: A man has reportedly killed his wife in the quiet suburbs of. Police have been called by scared neighbors as they heard shouting and crying. Which they thought was strange coming from their house as this has never happened before. Unfortunately, as the officers arrived on the scene, was heard was described as going and full of life. Her husband, 28 year old Michael, was seen as a Fucking goosebumps, man. We interrupt this program oh. with news. A man has reportedly killed his wife in the quiet suburbs of Police have been called by scared and crying. Strange coming from their house as this has never happened before. Oh, not what I did. As the officers arrived on the scene, a loud gunshot Doom da dee, doom da dee, dum dum, doom da dee. As he appeared in a trance-like state, the victim, 25-year-old Emily, was described as being happy, outgoing, and full of life. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! This horrible tragedy has come as a big shock to all the people who knew them, since they have always appeared as a cheerful and in love couple. The motive behind this seemingly strange murder is still under investigation, but the police have confirmed a single gunshot wound to the chest was the cause of Emily's death. The motive is still shrouded in mystery. Was it the sudden surge of uncontrollable anger, or was it the culmination of a long and simmering mental? <laughs>
What was that? We interrupt this program with breaking news. Come again? A man has reportedly killed his wife in the quiet suburbs of... Police have been called by scared neighbors as they heard shouting and crying. Which One more time. Which was strange coming from the house as this has never happened before. Unfortunately, as the officers arrived on the scene... Oh, are we getting to the end? Let that be the end, baby. A quiet but happy and well-adjusted man. This horrible tragedy has come as a big shock to all the people who knew them, since they have always appeared as a cheerful and... Fuck you. Fuck you. Fucked. Okay. At this point, the recording is an hour and a half, pretty much. It's been like 40 something minutes since I first said, you know, this dev is trolling. So I just kept pushing on and pushing on, trying to get to the end. My theory there are three options. A. The dev is fucking trolling, <laughs> and this was a 20 minute demo. B, I am dumb. <laughs> or C, there is a bug going on. Whatever it is, at this point, I feel like Michael or whoever the, the radio guy is talking about, I am absolutely ready myself just walking and walking and walking nothing happens or was it the culmination of a long and simmering <laughs> this is fucking frustrating because like i'm just going to continue to walk like what if this next one is the end but it's 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 not it's not the end the dev is fucking trolling. <laughs> he is fucking trolling. And I just keep... <laughs> yeah, let me know in, in the comments. What do you think? Did I miss something and I'm dumb? The dev is trolling. This is what it says. Pay attention to the small details. You will need five letters to unlock the padlock. They are hidden throughout the game. You will need to complete the body before proceeding to the ending. This totally does break the fourth wall. What is breaking the fourth fucking wall is there is no letters. There is no body parts. Don't waste your bullets. They have always appeared as a cheerful and in love couple. The motive behind Fuck the you. strange murder is still under investigation. The police have confirmed a single gunshot wound to the chest was the cause. That was multiple. Demise. Multiple. Multiple. The multiple. That led to this horrific act is still shrouded in mystery. If nothing happens at this door, at this fucking door. Yeah, I'm going to Ryan Reynolds myself. All this time. All of it. We interrupt this program with breaking news. A man has reportedly killed his wife in the quiet suburbs of <laughs> Police have been called by scared neighbors as they heard shouting and crying, which they thought was strange coming from their house. Yeah, I definitely got trolled. Don't forget to like, subscribe. The police were unable As always, I'm Uncle Gooey. Appreciate you for watching me getting trolled. <laughs> and as always, I'll see you in the next one. Five-year-old Emily was described as being outgoing and full of fun. Her husband, 28-year-old Michael Mead, was seen as a quiet but happy and well-adjusted man. This horrible tragedy has come as a big Oh yeah, and I've turned around, I've gone backwards at a certain point, and like... It's gonna stay out of order. Sorry, you can't go this way. It cuts it off, like... I'm not even moving.
Tank Act is still shrouded in mystery. Was it the sudden surge of uncontrollable anger? Or was it the culmination of a long and simmering mess? We interrupt this program with breaking news. A man has reported the murder of his wife in the quiet suburbs of Police have been called by scared neighbors as they heard shouting and crying. Which God, what am I doing with my life? from their house as this has never happened before. <laughs> the 